To finish our look at our first example, the guessing game with MVC edition, let's have a look at the deployment descriptor for this application. Recall that a deployment descriptor is an XML-based text file whose elements describe how to assemble and deploy the unit into a specific environment. The deployment descriptor elements contain behavioral information about components that are not included directly in code. The purpose is to tell the deployer how to deploy an application, not to tell the server how to manage components at runtime. For a Java-based web applications, the deployment descriptor is stored in a file called web.xml. With XML, each element consists of a tag and a value expressed to the following syntax, the tag, value, and slash tag, very much like HTML. For this application, most of us, we can see a deployment descriptor listed right below the name of the project in the Project Explorer window. Double-click, and it will open the web.xml file. Notice web.xml is on the tab that it's opened. Double-click that to get that full screen. There are two views for the web.xml, as you recall, the design view and the source view. Notice I'm clicking two tabs at the bottom left corner of the web.xml window. In the design view, all of the items stored in web, the XML file are basically stored as a GUI type list. In the source file, we actually see the XML tags. Here we see that we have the welcome file is index.jsp. So when we run our application, this is the first file that will load. Or also, generated into the XML file when we created our servlet was this code. There's the URL mapping. The mapping slash do guess will cause a servlet named game servlet to run. In the servlet section, we see that there's a servlet to control our guessing game. The logical name of the servlet is called game servlet. And the game servlet is connected to a Java class that is stored in the package controllers and also has the name game servlet. So when the application is deployed, the server will know that index is the welcome file and that any call to a slash do guess should cause the server to run the Java class stored in controllers package called game servlet. This has been a Piercy production.